Road trip to South Africa, day 4. We are travelling around Western Cape and planning to see today Victoria Bay, Mosul Bay from George and then go to Cape Aglas. This is a beautiful place, but it's too crowded. A quick stopover to take a picture of the haystack. Amit is there. Check it out. On our way to Herald's Bay, we came across this small town and it's having beautiful houses. We kind of lost our way, but we couldn't help but look at these houses. And check it out, you can see the ocean. We just arrived at Herald's Bay and there is a lot of people and we cannot find parking so my brother is waiting in the car and we are going to the beach take some clicks. After seashells this won't look that much good but we are here so we'll just see it. They have nice plenty houses over here which are very very beautiful. Boss. We are arrived at Harden Boss and this is an amazing place. I think if you come by the evening or night, it will look awesome. It's a sunset place, but uh, we won't be here around sunset, but this is a beautiful beach to be here. It's better than the rest of the things we've seen in George. This is on the way to Mosulbay. We arrived at Mosul Bay. We are going for lunch. The guy is taking us to some shack to have some seafood and there are a lot of surfers, beautiful beach and a lot of crowd.
We arrived at the Pavilion restaurant and we ordered uh, zesty lemon rice, uh, snails and cheese with some sandwich of bread they have provided and a seafood platter. It has prawns, calamari and then fish and some oysters and french fries on the side. We are on our way to Cape Agalhas and the road is completely deserted. We couldn't have seen a single soul on the road and it's so deserted and it's we are already late so we are trying to make it for the sunset there. We are definitely going to be late to our next hotel that's in Caledon. Cape Agulhas here the Indian Ocean meets with the Atlantic Ocean so we just arrived late at just past sunset it's a beautiful place you can see the board over here there's a proper walking trail made for the people to go it's 150 meter you can see we'll go towards that Finally we arrived at Three Oaks for the night and we are glad that the owner let us in at 10.30 pm in the night. Trust me the drive was horrible, it was pitch black, we shouldn't have drove in that uh, condition. We were not able to see a thing. Cozy place to call it a night. Like our video, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe our channel.